So what's my next documentary film project gonna be? Well, that's gonna be a problem. Sometimes I know exactly what I want, but the path to get there feels overwhelming. I tell myself it's too complicated, it's too far away, I have no idea how to get there. But then there's this side of me that says, hey, if you don't try, you'll never find out. That's how I ended up moving from Switzerland to the US, or when I gave up a successful nutrition practice to focus on documentary filming. Both felt very risky, but every time I pick up my camera, I know it was the right thing to do. It makes me happy. And now, here I am again. My dream is to create a new documentary film, but honestly, I have no idea how to pull it off. Yes, so for the past three years, I was working on my last big documentary project, which was called Gegenwind in German, Headwind. And it was about two guys who were sailing across the Mediterranean Sea on a small two by two meter catamaran. But essentially the film was about winning, because if you go and try something like that, you can't lose, because even if you fail, the fact that you tried makes you experience so much more uh, compared to all the others who stayed at home and did nothing. It was one of the best things I've ever done because for 30 days, there was just one objective and that was go film. Go film those two guys and capture whatever situation they ended up in. We had a theatrical run in 2022 and two months ago, I think in July, uh, the national broadcaster of Switzerland aired the film on their main channel, uh, which I think was a great wrap to an uh, awesome project. By the way, this morning fog, I love it. It's this marine layer in the morning and then the sun burns it off and then Usually we get a great, beautiful day. Like, I love it, it's really cool. So what's next in terms of a new documentary film? Well, that's gonna be a problem. Um, currently, I don't have one. I have some guidelines, like I would love to shoot outside again in nature, but exactly what it is, I don't know yet. So I have a principle that's called, you know, taking the first step and then see what happens because you, if you want to do something and, and you don't know how to get there, you just have to start with the first step. So the next step is uh, to brainstorm and I would love to do that with my partner in crime, Andreas Hilkinger, he's in Switzerland. I would love to talk with him about like our ideas and uh, what we want to do or what we don't want to do and then you know put that on a piece of paper and then go from there. At this point I appreciate all your inputs. There will be a time when you have to basically just go forward and not listen to too many people but right now that's the time to listen and ask people and friends and family and yeah the time's now for input.
So yes, uh, the next step is to do a brainstorm session, write down everything I and we can come up with and then share the outcome with you guys in the next video. Um, I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Tschüss.